So hello everyone welcome to my YouTube channel I hope you guys are doing great and today's video I'm going to talk about how you can add a basic rig into your character. So basically this video totally for a beginner if you guys just started your rigging journey with Blender so this video might be helpful for you because in this video I'm just going to talk about a basic fundamental how you can create a very basic rig and you don't need any add-on for that you just have a you know a single bone and with this single bone you can create a whole rig for your uh, basically uh, rig for your character and it will be like uh, help you uh, create a basic animation also so i'm just going to tell you how you can create a basic rig and how you can link with your body with uh, your character and i'll also tell you how you can move those uh, bones along with your hands so make sure you watch this tutorial uh, till end so now let's start the tutorial so first of all guys i'm just gonna uh, into my first view and i'll just press the uh, shift a and i'll just enable my shortcut vr first of all so you guys can easily see which key i'm pressing on the left hand side yeah on the left hand side you can see so first of all i'll just press the shift a and i'll just go to my amateur section and here i'll just add one single bone and here you can see it, it uh, will add into the uh, viewport something like that so now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to move this single bone and keep it here basically. And right now here you can see we can't see our bone because it is the middle of our character. And uh, if you want to see your bone on the top of your model, so what you need to do, you have to just go to your bone settings. Here you have to just go to your viewport display option. And after that you have to just click this in front option. And after that doesn't matter which view in you are, you can every time see your bone on top of your model and that's great for to visualize how our bone structure is going all right so now here you can see we have a good uh, bone here so now what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna edit mode of this bone pressing the tab and first one i'm just gonna little small this bone and i'm just gonna create a three bone here basically so here you can see yeah something like that and from here I'm just going to enable my mirror so we can just easily uh, create a bone something like that now here you can see I'm just going to extrude again pressing the E and again extrude something like that again I'll just go to my left view and I'm just going to create a bone something like that now here you can see we have a these kind of bones here now same thing we'll just do with our uh, hand bone here you can see i'm just gonna extrude it and now i'm just gonna extrude and keep it here keep it here and same thing i'll do with the other side yeah something like that and now i'm just gonna extrude one more time and same thing i'll just do on the left hand side now i'll just go to my uh, top view and make sure you just select your both bones and just move it little bit inside basically something like that and same thing you will do with your uh, leg bones okay and just select uh, those two bones and just do a little bit inside a uh, little bit outside and just keep those bones little bit inside something like that i think everything look nice to me now i'm just going to create one head bone I'll just extrude it and keep this into the neck and again I'll just create one more bone and I'm just gonna extrude it something like that so now here you can see guys we have a basic bone structure and now with the help of this bone structure we can just link all those bones with our body and after that we can just move our body along with our bones so i'm just going to tell you how you can do that so first of all make sure your all objects should be selected you can just press a and you can also drag and drop uh, over this character you can select all the object inside that rectangular box basically here you can see and after that make sure you just press the shift and select our bone 
uh, twice and now here you can see if you will see the that orange selection that's mean that is the active selection and after that you have to just press the control p and another dialog box will be appear after pressing the control p and here you will see we have a set parent dialog box so i'm just gonna do set parent as a with automatic fade so what is does exactly with automatic weight option it is automatically divide the each bones according to their heights and after that what what will happen all bones will link uh, along with our bones so i'm just going to click it and it will take little time all right so after that here you can see i'm just going to show you uh, the rig with the body so here you can see if i'm just going to move mode of this uh, rig and if i just move any bone from this rig so now here you can see our body is perfectly moving and that's how you can just add a basic rig and move your body according to your desire. Now here you can see. That's look awesome by the way. Alright, so in the next lecture, I'm just going to talk about how you can create a IK and FK rig using the Blender. So we'll just continue this series and if you also wanted to learn more about the character rigging in Blender, so make sure to, to comment below and to show your interest. I'll definitely make the another part also. So thanks for watching this video guys. If you learned something in this video, please hit the like button and the share button and subscribe my channel. Also, if you have any queries or fame session, do let me know in the comment box. I'll definitely reply comment. So bye bye, take care and stay home guys.